Hello friends, uh, welcome to Coding Simplified. In last tutorial, we saw the implementation of for loops, and today we will see the implementation of while loop. So the difference between for loop and while loop is that in for loop we have three section: initialization, then condition, and then iteration. While in a while loop we have only condition, right? So like uh, you can see the structure, uh, we have only the condition in this section. So uh, we can initialize before the loop as well as we can do iteration in the body. Right, so this is how we differentiate between the to the for loop. Right, so like in this case, we have initialized by i equal to 0 before the loop and we are checking the condition. So this condition is a Boolean value. So either this is true or this is false. So if this condition is true, then it goes inside the body right so like in this case uh, i is 0 so 0 is less than 3 so it will print this line which is value equal to 0 and then for the iteration we can give i plus plus so it will increment the i value and then again it will check the condition that whether like in like now i equal to 1 so 1 is less than 3 yes so again the condition is true again it will print this statement and it will iterate the value so it will keep on executing this statement till the condition matches as soon as this condition is false then it will exit from the loop so like if you run this program you will see that it will print 0 1 and 2 because when it is 3 and 3 is less than 3 is not valid so it will exit from the loop and uh, similarly with the for loop while loop is also top nested loop means first it check the condition and then it execute the statement right so the important point is that we need to declare this variable before the while loop like you cannot uh, you cannot say uh, like int i equal to zero error Right. this will give you an error it need to be declared before the loop so this is correct thing and another thing is that let's suppose if you declare a variable and but the while value this condition does not match even on the first instance so like you say i equal to 10 and our condition says i should be less than 3 which does not matches so it won't go inside the statement even once and it will directly go from here to here so if you print this let's say outside the loop and if you run this program this will just print outside loop it won't go inside this right so friends this is all about the while loop and for more information you can visit the www.codingsimplified.com and in next tutorial we will see about the do while loop used in java so please like the video and subscribe my channel and thank you